In the heart of the Soviet Union, beneath the veil of secrecy, a catastrophe unfolds in the closed city of Chelyabinsk 40, now known as Ozyorsk. On September 29, 1957, an invisible menace rises into the sky. A buried tank holding 70 to 80 tons of high-level radioactive waste overheats after its cooling system fails. Unnoticed for over a year, the temperature climbs to 350 degrees Celsius. Then, a chemical explosion erupts, blasting a 160-ton concrete lid into the air. A plume of radioactive dust ascends a kilometer high, drifting northeast over 20,000 square kilometers, silently contaminating the land and its inhabitants. Villagers witness a strange bluish violet glow in the sky. Unaware of the danger, they continue their lives as radioactive particles settle around them. Within days, livestock perish, crops wither, and mysterious illnesses emerge. Skin peels from faces and hands. Fear and confusion spread. The government, cloaked in silence, evacuates over 10,000 people, some not until two years later. The affected zone, known as the East Ural Radioactive Trace, remains contaminated for decades. The world remains oblivious until 1976, when Soviet biologist Joris Medvedev exposes the disaster. The Kishtim disaster, as it's named after the nearest known town, ranks as the third most severe nuclear accident, yet it remains shrouded in obscurity. In the shadows of the Cold War, the Earth bears the scars of secrets buried deep.